I was terrified of it. I think that's why. And I think, um, you know, I think, uh, weirdly, I've sort of been pushing myself um, with the, you know, more and more challenges as my career goes on, really. Um, but Elizabeth is sort of, she's so different to me, but also similar in lots of weird ways. When I first read the books, you know, um, many years ago, I really appreciated the character and I thought she was really different and... Um, I loved the way she lived her life, which was without judgment, really, and in her own way. She was sort of living outside the system. Um, and I just thought she was great. I thought she was really witty and funny and intelligent. Um, and I, I find it very interesting to play someone who everybody would say, oh, she's really cool and she's really this and she's really that, and that's not how she sees herself. I think what people see of her and how she sees herself are two completely different things, and I really love that challenge of it. The main thing for me was to find a cast that was intriguing and, and interesting and, and fascinated. So, and, and that means usually people that you haven't seen before or you haven't seen a lot of. And, um, or, or, act, or actors like, like Claire Foy, where you've seen it, but you've never seen them in something like this, playing something like this. You've seen the actor thing playing something completely different. So, so even if you have seen it, it's one of the things that you, you, it will take you a while to go like, wait a second, is this a person that I've found this other thing? Uh, uh, so th that was the main thing, to find people that would be new faces for the big audience. So we really went through, you know, many, many corners of the world trying to find the best actors to play these roles and to really find fresh and exciting faces that, that will, that would allow you also to buy into this world better and just see them not as, oh, this person that plays all these other roles, but just as a, you know, just see them as the role they're playing, right? What I can see in him that I have is uh, is that when I get interested in something, I can't let it go. I have to, I, I get obsessed, and uh, he's kind of the same way. He he just continues, and he's a digging journalist, and and uh, so I think that's uh, the thing that got me most interested in him. If you let that take over, right, the being faithful to every detail of the novels or, or, or what the world, the, what the audience, the fans believe the character is, if you're too faithful to that, you might not service them and you might end up some, doing something that, well, it maybe it, it suffers as a movie, you never know. So the, the thing that for me I have to serve the most is the film itself, if I have to do the best film I can. And that's why I'm thinking every day and every, every decision I make, how do I make the best possible film I can to entertain the audience and keep them hooked till the end. And, and, and that sometimes implies that there's some things that you're going to overlook or, you, you, or things, elements of the book that you cannot include because it will be too much. And books and films are like completely different formats, right? I'd love to be coy and be like, I, I may have, I don't have any tattoos. It's not, um, the um, amazing makeup designer has had them all made and we made, decided what we were doing together, really. Um, the dragon had a lot of input into it, what, what shape the dragon should be, what sort of dragon it should be, which um, was quite funny. And then we just did all the other ones. And I've loved them, really. They really kind of make you feel like you've, you're adorned, even though, you know, um, you haven't actually got anything on. Um, and it sort of made me think, maybe I should get a tattoo. Um, I don't think I'll get a Lisbeth tattoo, but you never know. When I'm 70, I might, you know, get something. I think uh, you have different kinds of journalists, of course. And... Uh and I've always been interested in, in the kind that's, that's digging up uh, information and, and going deep into, into stories. So I like documentaries.